just because it's back to school time doesn't mean we have to abandon our parks. On the contrary, our Parks and Recreation Department is continuing to do a new program called Pop-Up Parks through the month of August. We stopped at Floyd Land Park at Tule Springs to see what these pop-up parks entail. Pop-Up Parks and Rec is a mobile van that we're going around to five scheduled parks and in the future we're just going to pop up in our city parks and we do games, activities, crafts depending on the weather. I have my 10 and 11 year old and 4 year old here and they're loving the water game. Me and my sister like race against each other and like it's just so fun. They have the water activities and they teach the kids how to hoo hoo hoo. So um, it's just great. I think that it's like very fun and amazing that because not all cities like have all these things going on. We've just recently started, so we're getting a little bit of a following. So I'm really excited about that, seeing the same faces, the same kids. They'll start helping others play the games. And I think I've taught more people to play checkers this summer than I ever have. Actually, we went to the pop-up park last week. Um, it was at Levitt Justice Park, I believe. And then they did making kites, and so my four-year-old got to fly a kite for the first time. It's nice for them to um, do this so people can actually get outside and have fun. You know, it's 110 out, and people are still happy to be outside. Come out, take advantage of, you know, the city activities. They're free. They're fun. Um, you get to meet other families. Uh, your kids can meet other kids. For more information on pop-up parks and all of Park and Recreation's great activities and programs, you can go to 702-229-PLAY.